Hello, this is Ami Diamond. In this episode, I'd like to show you actually a new uh, feature that actually just popped up. So in the up bar, we, we have actually the global navigation. If we click on it, uh, if we set it up also, you'll see here navigation. You need to set the site to be um, home site. We'll see the, the recent uh, sites that you visited and the ones that you follow. You can see some um, news. You can see recent documents. You can see the recent uh, lists. And we have a plus button. So this plus button actually uh, lets you uh, create all of these types uh, no matter where you are in SharePoint. So first thing is actually we can create a site. We can choose between a team site and a communication site. Team site is connected to our Office 365 group. Then you can connect to Teams. Communication site is not connected, but it's mostly uh, for web content management, for portals and, and things like that. So uh, let's just create a new team site. Let's give it a name. And uh, the name is taken. And actually what we can do is uh, demo and uh, and then the site is created. Okay, so that's that's for the uh, the team, and actually it moved me to the team. Here I can create a, a word document. It will be stored in in the OneDrive. Uh, we afterwards can decide where we want to put it. Uh, to rename the name, we just click here. Just click here and give it a name. Let's do let's call it demo. And uh, by default, it's in the OneDrive. If we want to change it, we can click the arrow and we can move it to anywhere we want uh, from the OneDrive or to a different uh, site. So uh, you see, I moved this and it's now moving this uh, document and uh, that's it. Okay, so let's go on actually. We will click and we'll see that you can create a spreadsheet. Here's a spreadsheet. Um, let's go back. I'll click the plus and the presentation. All of these applications are uh, web. They're not desktop, but actually uh, you can open it in a web, in a desktop as well. Uh, OneNote creates actually a, a notebook, uh, so let's give a name, uh, Notebook1, create a OneNote. By default, it's also stored in OneDrive, and you can share it. Uh, last option actually is a list, as you saw. So we can create a list, and uh, it will offer us to create from um, blank from Excel, from the existing, or using the templates. Uh, notice that we have uh, new templates here like gift idea and uh, expense tracker and other things. So um, this is uh, the experience with the new plus button in SharePoint. Uh, currently I'm in public preview, so you, you might not see it. Uh, it was, was there before, but it went away and now it's back. So uh, test it and see what you think. Goodbye.